The film Avatar by the acclaimed director James Cameron premiered more than 10 years ago, but it's still a pretty impressive movie. It has inspired directors, artists, designers, and apparently even car manufacturers. On January 2020, Mercedes-Benz presented a show car inspired by the adventures of the inhabitants of the planet Pandora. According to the designers of this futuristic car, it embodies the connection between man, machine, and nature, and the dream of a society in which these three elements coexist in perfect symbiosis. At first sight, the car looks more like the creation of a group of graphic designers rather than a real car. Its body is equipped with movable glass doors and unusual spherical wheels with glowing inserts. However, the most unusual feature of the new show car of the German company is the 33 moving aerodynamic elements in the back of the car. All the details of the exterior glow thanks to a special technology, and their glow can be synchronized with the beating of the driver's heart. By the way, let's talk about the driver. Like almost all modern concept cars, Vision AVTR is equipped with unmanned driving technology, so there are no usual controls in its cabin. Instead, you can find four original hammock seats, similar to those seen in Avatar, as well as screens with holographic images. The interior of the car is made of environmentally friendly materials, for example, artificial leather by Dynamica. The concept car is also equipped with several electric motors with a total capacity of 470 horsepower. The 110 kilowatt hour battery is free of toxic and expensive elements, recharges in 15 minutes, and is recyclable. To start the car, just put your hand on the unit, symbolizing the Tree of Souls from Avatar. It is already known that this miracle of automobile design will not be mass-produced, but some stylistic and technical solutions discovered during its creation will be used in other Mercedes-Benz products. DSX e -tents. This incredible car by DS, a premium automobile mark part of the group PSA, came to us straight from the future. Originally conceived as a single-seater concept car, it can be operated in standalone or manual mode. Thus, you can be a passenger or a driver if you feel like it. The car is equipped with two electric motors, which together can boast a power of 1300 horsepower. It goes from 0 to 100 km per hour in just over 3.5 seconds, and the maximum speed is 225 km per hour. The interior of the car was designed with the help of several premium French companies. Everything here breathes luxury, from the seats to the audio system. The car has many original elements too. A crystal-shaped dashboard, an X-shaped steering wheel, fancy seats, diamond-shaped speakers housed in the wooden dashboard, and much more. By the way, here's another curious detail. Thanks to a special technology, the car body is able to return to its original form after any damage or accident, and the temperature and lighting inside are adjusted to the needs of the passenger or the driver. Mercedes-Benz Vision EQ Silver Arrow The Mercedes-Benz Vision EQ Silver Arrow is another concept car from the German automaker. Essentially, it's a tribute to the racing cars of the same company, developed back in the 1930s. The car is about 5.3 meters long and 1 meter tall. The body has a streamlined shape and is almost devoid of sharp edges. The design of the concept car is stunning, but no less impressive are its technical characteristics. For instance, the electric power unit has a capacity of 550 kilowatts or 750 horsepower. The 80 kilowatt hour battery allows the car to travel up to 400 kilometers on one charge. Lightyear 1 At first glance, this car doesn't look like much due to its modest design. 
but it will definitely surprise you. Its creators, the Dutch startup Lightyear, claim to have built the world's first solar-powered car that can accommodate a whole family, thanks to its five seats. The car is powered exclusively by green energy and it's highly efficient. When fully charged, the vehicle has an average power reserve of 725 kilometers, and in cold seasons, the driving range reaches 400 kilometers. Solar panels are installed on the roof and on the hood of the vehicle. The recharging speed of the battery pack depends on the weather, too. On a sunny, clear day, the rate can be very high, and in winter, it can be reduced by almost half. The vehicle accelerates to 100 km per hour in just 10 seconds. Next year, it's scheduled to go into mass production. Hispano Suiza Carmen before World War I, the Spanish company Hispano Suiza stood out among car manufacturers and was as famous as Rolls Royce. From 1904 to 1946, the company produced over 12,000 luxury cars. However, until recently, the attempts to revive the company have failed. However, this hypercar can become a game changer. The car you're seeing on the screen has a capacity of 750 kilowatts or 1019 horsepower. It needs just over three and a half seconds to reach 100 kilometers per hour, while its maximum speed is 250 kilometers per hour. At the moment, the estimated range of the car on one charge is 400 kilometers, but in the near future, this figure is going to increase. This luxury hypercar will not be mass produced though. It's expected that 19 vehicles will be made, each worth 1.5 million euros or even more. Pininfarina Batista this Italian beauty is worth about two and a half million dollars, but experts are sure that this car is not overpriced at all. Here is just one fact. The vehicle reaches 160 km per hour in only two seconds. It is faster than a Formula One car. You can drive about 450 km on one charge as well. You can recharge it up to 80% in just 40 minutes. Four electric motors, one for each wheel, with a total capacity of 1,877 horsepower, are powered by a traction battery with a capacity of 120 kilowatt hours. The maximum speed of this amazing car is about 350 kilometers per hour. Pal V Liberty When we were all young, all of us dreamed that one day cars would learn to fly. Well, it's finally happened. Not so long ago, the Dutch company Pal V International started taking orders for the Pal V Liberty, the world's first flying car production model. In fact, there were lots of similar attempts before, but none of them have reached the stage of mass production. This car costs about the same as an ordinary helicopter. So, what makes it better? Well, firstly, the brainchild of Dutch engineers can reach the takeoff point on its own. That's a big plus. Secondly, it's versatile. On public roads, the 100 horsepower engine allows the car to accelerate to 100 km per hour in 9 seconds and travel at a maximum speed of 160 km per hour. It takes no more than 10 minutes to switch the PAL V to flight mode, after which the car with a traction motor of 200 horsepower requires at least 330 meters of acceleration for takeoff. The maximum flight speed is about 180 km per hour. Naturally, to operate this vehicle, you need both a driver's license and a gyroplane pilot license.